Welcome back. Man, this one looks pretty good today. Another test drive coming your way. 1969 Chevy Chevelle. Does have the 396 under the hood with power steering, power brakes. This thing is super clean. Now, of course, throughout any of my test drive videos, I'll show you dents, scratches, rust, anything that I can see or if there's anything wrong with this ride. Be sure to hit subscribe and share this channel. Dual exhaust out the back. 100 detailed pictures, financing, and shipping's available. Please hit subscribe. It's about that time. Let's go for a ride. All right, before we take off, place those bets. Do you think the horn works? Got a decent console here. Nice interior. Back seat looks good. Package tray looks awesome. Headliner on this one's been redone. Pretty cool. We'll go ahead and start this one up. Showing 80,000 miles on the dash. Wipers work. Lower motor's not working. How about today we got one of the local news channels over there behind the yellow Chevelle and they came up. They wanted to get some footage of the lot. I thought that was pretty cool. I was like, go for it, man. He said, free publicity. News Channel 2. It'll be airing here soon. I don't know what they're... He said it was all good stuff. I think they were talking about the storm damage that happened last year, so... Turn signals. Flashing both sides. Well, what do you think? Horn? Nope, horn's not hooked up. Well, let's hit the road, see how it runs and drives. Hey, look, I picked up a uh, passenger princess. <laughs> <laughs> now we're going to yeah. get some lunch. He, he pulled in over here. He bought himself a new vehicle as well today. And uh, I said, dude, I'm starving. We got to go to lunch. We definitely need to get some gas. Might do that before we go. But right next door, where we're going to eat. Woo, shift kit. That's a big shift kit. It's got the big block. Let's see what it does, yeah. Okay, I'm barely touching. I'm big towing it right now. We're going to slow on down and do that again. Getting in the brakes. The brakes do feel good. Speedometer is working. Coming to a stop here. Let's get into the throttle a little bit. <laughs> Not too bad. We got tight steering, a little bit of a left pull when you hit the brakes. It's really not that bad though, it's just a little bit. Now I'm talking about about half to 60% throttle is what I just gave it. I didn't floor it, but it did kick down and took off. So that's pretty cool. Gas gauge I'm gonna say is not working. Seems to be running and driving pretty good. Definitely built up the trans and stuff. Somebody was having fun with this one. I like those mirrors too with a little rubber around the outside of them. Fancy. Well, what we're gonna do is pull into this gas station over here, get a little bit of fuel. And then we're gonna be doing undercarriage shots like we normally do, pass the camera, have a little fun. Picking out the flaws is at the end. That's how the story goes. Guys, I'll be back. All right, so we got $20 with the premium fuel in this ride. Well, sort of premium. This one, 100% gasoline. Yeah, it's on the premium side go ahead and check our gauge I already know it don't work yeah way past full that means probably a connection on the tank let's get out of here
it's time to roll. Heading on back to the lot where we're gonna be picking out the flaws. in those brakes nice and smooth back at our throttle she feels great Engine's pretty smooth on it too. I think this one being black on black, it's gonna sell pretty quick, really. Especially with the big block. Brakes are touchy too, they stop fast. Hear that fan hitting the shroud or something. Fan's hitting something under there bump in the road pretty smooth yeah we're gonna check on the fan during the walk around we'll see what's going on there and that picking out the flaws segment it's getting ready to come up because we're getting ready to pull back into the lot guys be sure to hit subscribe and share this video that's gonna help us out I'll see you here in a minute We're back at the lot and we're gonna walk this ride. So, throughout the test drive, when I got on it, I heard the fan hitting the fan shroud. It is extremely close and you can actually see the search spots where it was touching. It is very close. Around the front end, little dings. Pitting on your front bumper, a little scuffed up. Scuff over here on the edge. Scratch on the side. A little chip. Mid section. This paint job is awesome, guys. She looks great. A little bit of pitting on your door handle. Chrome there. Got a little rust growing up. Pillar's got some cracks up top. Front windshield, a couple little chips. Down in the jam there, a little bubbling popping up. Roof looks good. Seal's in good shape. Touch up mark. Touch up mark there, cracking the paint. Pitting on the tail light.
little dings on your trim. Coming up to the back. Rear bumper on this one's a little bit pitted as well. Seal looks good. Got some patching in the trunk. A lot of patching in the trunk. A lot of silicone used over there in the corner. Package tray's clean. Trunk lid looks all right. Bubbles on the edge. Fitting on the emblem. It is shut down now. <clears throat> Coming down this side. spot there chip here chips A bubble in the corner chip in the corner behind the bumper midsection hitting on your emblem but on back A little scuff there Fitting on your handle. And over the top of the rear fender. Trim's kind of sticking up. A little bit of pitting here. On your pillar. Bubbles up top. Down in your jams. Crack here. Couple chips. Little dings. Over the front windshield here. Light little chips. Back there. All right, made it around the outside of this one. We'll go ahead and check out the interior. <clears throat> Door panel looks pretty good. To the door has been fixed. Looks like that plate's been added too. Little wrinkles in the back. Headliner looks cool though. I like how they did a custom headliner in this one, missing the light cover. 
got a spot on the top of the seat. Carpet's decent, pedal's decent. Coming down with the hood here. I'm gonna lock her up. Chip on top. Guys, thank you very much for watching 100 Detailed Pictures and Financing. And shipping is available. Just go to maplemotors.com if you're interested. If you've seen something in this video you want me to go over again, no problem. We can obviously do that and send you more if you are interested in buying this car. Every week we're getting new rides in. Be sure to check on Mondays. And I'll see you in the next one.